One of the most important beliefs that people have about politicians is that politicians do whatever polls tell them to do. We hear a lot of complaint about the lack of strong leadership, that politicians find out what the public wants and then they pander to it, or at least they say they'll pander to it. Now what this idea of the poll-driven politician creates is the impression that the political system may have all kinds of problems, but on the whole, it's responsive and accountable to the public. But once you actually start to look at public opinion in a more detailed way, what you discover is that the idea of the poll-pandering politician is really a myth. For example, there's broad support in the US for a whole range of policies. Polls show that most people support increased spending on inner cities, uh, more spending and regulation on the environment, more spending on education, more spending on health care. We also find that majorities support increases in the minimum wage, stricter gun control, and campaign finance reform. In other words, if politicians really were poll-driven, then they'd be in favour of a whole range of liberal or left-wing policies, when in fact they're not. Now the question that this raises in a democracy is how is this mismatch between what the people want and the policies pursued by their representatives possible?